Hey, so guys, today we are going to play Night Elves. Oh boy. Yeah, normally I would uproot my barracks this very second, but approaching the barracks, you know. Okay, yeah, there are two ways of playing this. We either get a source of magic, that's a meta build, or we go for scenarios. Scenarios is also good because it regenerates your buildings. And he's way better than Mountain Giant. Way, way, way better. So, like, if you are playing Night Elves, you have two things you wanna pick from. It's either scenarios or source of magic. Alright, let's go scenarios. We have a Tauren on the bottom, being played by Stefan, we have a Felorc in front of us, having one defense upgrade already, being played by Richard. And we have a Troll, playing by Gokalp on the top of us. So why, why Scenarius is so good? Well, at level 15 Scenarius gets an item uh, that gives regeneration to all the Ancients uh, globally. So I have five sec, five HP per second regeneration on, on all my buildings and trends around the map. Just so you know. So like, if I keep spamming scenarios late game, my buildings gonna have insane regeneration. I just gotta keep them alive. If I keep, as long as I keep my alive, my buildings is fine. Um. And uh, yeah, the second thing is source of magic. If I w would go for a source of magic, my druids have would have insane damage. I would have another point in the poison upgrade, which is amazing thing to have. And yeah, it's just like, it's very good. Also, defensive spells cost less. So yeah, my, in my opinion, scenarios and the source of magic are the best upgrades in game, and you just play around them. They are excellent. Scenari in my opinion, scenarios is a little bit weaker, but a little bit more fun to play, definitely. Like, you have way more fun playing with a big ass scenarios, you know. He's a very strong guy. Uh, compared to the Mountain Giant, the super unit you have. Yeah, it's kind of like that. Okay. Going to upgrade the Varric to the best, to the better neutral buildings. We have a Lumber Mill here and a War Mill. On the other side, we have a Sacrificial Pit and a Stone Quarry. Stone Quarry gives your buildings extra armor. Uh, sacrificial Pit gives you decreased damage to your enemies. Uh, the Lumber Mill gives you HP regeneration for the buildings, and the War Mill gives damage to your units. Like 8% or something. So, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, Richard, you can't upgrade to my side. It's, oh, it's Stefan. Yeah, it's Stefan on Tauren. My bad. He actually upgraded on mid first. <laughs> what is going on? Yeah. Yeah, that's a little bit unusual for him to do so. I don't I, I feel like I'm forced to mash it because he might rush upgrades now. So, like, the sooner I mash it, the better it is, but I don't know. Maybe I upgrade on top first. Maybe not. Uh, Stefan did match my upgrade on the, the barrack. Okay. Okay, okay. Literally still not banned, should I fix that? No. Leave it be. They have the fog. Uh, the dragon hoax in the Scarlet Crusade in LTA. It sounds so weird. It sounds like so, so weird. Are you sure like the real dragon hoax? Maybe yes, maybe I just forgot about them. So, true. Okay, not many upgrades so far. One mastery upgrade for Torin, uh, tier 2 barrack. A go Kalp upgraded on my side. Matched mine. Okay, okay, okay. Did anyone upgrade on mid? Except Richard. It's looking, this is looking very scary, okay? Like, I feel like he might push me anytime soon. Skull Shooter didn't have a Babalas boss. 
Map's name was an instant ban. Does anyone like uh, follow uh, Coach Nathaniel still or like not? How's he doing right now on YouTube? Because I'm not very YouTube frog. I don't watch any Warcraft content creators on YouTube at all. Nor Wimp, nor like uh, Grabby, nor like any anyone. Like I, I, I just like I have so much Warcraft in my veins that I, I end the stream. I, 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 I don't watch any Warcraft content at all. Like I, I literally hate it, mate. <laughs> literally hate it. Wasn't he on Mixer? Yeah, but I feel like he didn't like it so much, so he went for streaming on YouTube, if I'm not mistaken. Or something. I feel like he's streaming on YouTube right now, making videos on YouTube. Which is not too bad, you know, like it's... If I... Yeah, I probably would stream on YouTube if it's not uh, on Twitch. Like, I wouldn't really move to Mixer, but I would move to YouTube, probably. I think it's a better idea. Naito's a difficult race, what's your strat? Uh, just go for a lot of upgrades on the damage and defense. Uh, I, I'm getting rushed, so I'm like being pressured right now quite a lot. Like, I bought already 7 units. That's like way too much. Way too much. Than it should be. But yeah, not much I can do about it, you know, like it's. I upgrade on bottom, then top gets upgraded, and mid get upgraded against me, so like, yeah, it's just too much. Ah, but we're gonna stabilize once I will do my upgrades, you know? Difficult CAC, Knight of the one of the strongest race late game. But early it's difficult. Early it's very difficult. I have my HP regeneration, but like, yeah, this guy has already higher upgrades than me. Uh, like, I don't know, man. Torrens, way stronger early game. Felhort has the research speed upgrade. My upgrades have been made very, very, very slowly. You can see it like research speed minus 20. So early, I'm way slower developed race than. Anyone else, you know? Yeah, and uh, yeah, he rushed his upgrades. I, I'm trying to catch up. That's a lot of units there. Yeah, I bought 11 units already. I feel like it was around 8 or 9 transmorphs and 200 says right? So I literally wasted um, 650 gold. 650 gold wasted on buying units. Just so you know, okay? <laughs> that could be like double upgrades on armor. The first and the second. That's a big wave. I'm kind of scared. I feel like I gotta use everything I have. I know how he stacks such a big wave though. But yeah, he surely did. Torrent will unit like late game, so don't need to rush him. Yeah, Kappa. I bought all my melee units and I'm still leaking. Do you see what I see? I feel like I don't need more units. This is too much. This is just too much, mate. I'm going further than 2-3. Oh, very interesting. Okay, I'm gonna wait until I have another entangle, and then I'm gonna launch uh, a caster upgrade. Yeah, I need a caster upgrade now. Like 10 times already. There you go, okay. Elsa OP. They're kind of strong late game, yeah, but wouldn't say they're uh, like that OP, you know. They're decent, they're decent. Uh, because I have, like, I have probably one of the worst GPMs right now. I have actually the best GPM. Oh yeah, I wasted. 17 units bought, okay? So, 650 from this barracks, and then... 850... 1k, 50 gold. 1050 gold, I wasted on buying units. Man. 
This is so bad. So maybe I'm gonna skip messenger early and catch up with it like late game. I don't know. Cause I need to tag soon. I need to tag soon. I'm gonna be so behind if I don't tag soon. Infernox on me it. Was it on purpose? I feel like it was. Divine Armor Inferno, Pog Champ. The free armor upgrades. Oh yeah, it's gonna dominate the mid. Like we, we do zero damage to this thing. This is so broken. Well sometimes we should play and I will I will wreck you. I play with my pilot and usually win. Don't just both don't die and don't deal damage or something and they stack fast. <laughs> kind of true. Oh, go Kalp, go Kalp, go Kalp! Nice, he reacted. Double defensive spells though. Why both of them? Just like buy two units and use your Z and that's it. But yeah, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, we are taking, we skip the mercenary upgrades. To get, uh, yeah, like, two tier two faster. It's pretty important right now, I feel like yeah, I'm, I'm losing, so... Let's get an aura, and then... Uh, Trans of Wisps, let's get Trans first. 10% chance. 10% chance. It didn't press that for some reason, so I used the big one. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. What's the reason defensive spell, huh? Very interesting. Uh, Richard sent his hero on mid, I think. So he's trying to push me. I uh, just gotta keep an eye if he's gonna get a tier 3 upgrade on mid with flat. Because if he will not, it's nothing serious. But if he will, then yeah, it's a problematic for me. So I I want uh, the Wisps and I want the Trans. One level and then I continue with the stats. Just like armor and damage upgrades. Three, five upgrades on units. Uh, kind of big yikes. Kind of big yikes. And then Infernos as well. Oh boy! Oh boy! That's um... Scary looking army coming at my base. Do I even have time to launch this upgrade? Yep. Oh, Infernos expired. Nice. Okay. Then I can, I think. I think I can. There is also poison that I like a lot. Uh, poison is just very OP. Very, very good. It's a pure damage. It's not magic damage, not physical, it's just pure. I can sell the upgrade or make units. I think make units. Because I will never get to the upgrades otherwise. Okay, pull. So he kind of fed us with this warlock of his. Uh, yep, pretty nicely done. A big wave from the middle, a hero as well on top of it. We have a lot of cash right now, which we can get, which we can use in the on the barracks and uh, upgrades. Okay. Let's get a uh, caster level 2. We have uh, 5 free upgrades on units. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, not too bad. I've tried to go for Force of Nature uh, more, to be honest. Like, I checked what the trends are. 
when they have like it's a trend or a greater trend or an ancient trend it doesn't give too much their hp buffs like by 100 and a bit of damage but that's just not not that good level one trend is already like decent you you don't need more you don't need more for that amount of gold especially oh yeah i gotta get bounces for huntresses i forgot about that that's a mistake that's a very good upgrade that's a very good upgrade basically like doubles almost doubles the damage that your huntresses input there's a 10 percent damage loss uh per bounce but they also get like six damage yeah this one is very good maybe i'm gonna mix it but not sure uh, maybe i should get poison as well yeah let's get poisoned why not let's get poisoned one level for now uh get the second caster upgrade Then more damage. Yeah, like Night Elf has 20% mi minus 20% research speed. So yeah, like really, really, really forced to be doing these upgrades early. Like there, there is no way. You can you can't not go for the stats early. Even if like you're not playing my strats where I do it on every race, like it's still like I feel like it's impossible. If you will try to catch up mid game or late game with the upgrades, they're just being made way slower. The difference between my research speed and the fell horde, fell or research speed is uh, like 30% basically, right? He has like plus 10, I have minus 20, so the difference is uh, 30. Yeah, there is a tier 3 barrack uh, below me. I gotta upgrade my barrack as well because of that. But I'm being a little bit greedy. I'm getting this defense upgrade just in case, you know. First. Uh, it's it's kind of good. You you do need it, you know, so... Yeah. After that, I'm gonna upgrade the barrack. Make ants. Yeah, I have them. I have both the wisps and the ants. Trends. Richardic has a lot of cash. I know, I feel like it's someone is feeding him. Like someone is upgrading his barrack on on him, I don't know. But yeah, that does look suspicious to me. It does look suspicious to me. Why he has so much cash? I doubt it's because of me. It might be because of me. How do I check the gold from the middle? Is it GM? Yes. Yeah, he has a lot of cash from the middle, I guess. But consider that he used a hero, so like minus 1k. And then that's his uh, profit. Also, not everyone upgraded on mid. Maybe everyone did. Throw didn't, yeah, throw didn't. So that's good. Alright. Both the players upgraded, both the side laners upgraded uh, their tier 3, their barracks to tier 3. I gotta match both right now before I do anything else. We have one level in Wisp, Trend, uh, Moonglaive, and Poison. Basically, the most important upgrades. I do like the crit, but I feel like it's better for the late game, like when you already upgrade everything. Poison damage input is uh, much bigger, in my opinion. So, yeah, the plan is to upgrade the Barrack to tier 3. Uh, finish the defensive upgrades, get probably two mercenary upgrades, finally, because we do need it. Uh, maybe a few defense upgrades. The benefit to the trends. These little guys, where are they? Well, if I will find the trend, I will show you. Also benefits from these upgrades. From the nature's wrath. What's up, Orlando? How are you doing? What was your foundation? Scenarios. I'm playing with snows, yeah. So this guy benefits from nature's wrath upgrades. It will be a very big wave from the from the Tauren. Uh, he has Earth Shield level one. I don't know if he has rejuvenation. Uh, not like very big upgrades. Not very big upgrades, but they are still looking decent. Uh, this push does. I am starting to control the meat. I don't know why. Pretty interesting. I feel like Richardic might send me a super unit on mid. Because he is saving gold for something. He does he doesn't go for the magic upgrades. Oh he has 8-6! He's already tier 3 and he has two extra upgrades. 
Oh my god, what the... What is this threat? This is so weird. <laughs> Yo. Um, okay. Well. Very big wave coming from the blue. I will have to use the Star of Hope, most likely. I don't think there is any other way around it. Uh, problem is that, like, yeah, I can't really launch my slow upgrade, because this wave gonna come soon. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Also, I can't really go on the passives, on the tower upgrades too much. Uh, the main reason is because my foundation is scenario, so I'm, I'm forced to be, like, going tier 3 fast, not tower upgrades. Which is fine. Moonglave level 2 are good, but cost a lot. Poison level 2 is also good, but also cost a lot. So we're gonna go for objectives first. Gonna go for objectives first. Okay, cast it. Now. And launch the upgrade. Should be fine now. Should be fine now. So we finish the armor upgrades, uh, we take to tier 3. Uh, tier 3 on mid by Richard. Hmm. Should I match it? Uh, no, I don't think so. Yeah, he gonna dominate the mid because of that, but... I don't know. Yeah, so we gotta finish our uh, 6 upgrades on defense, then tech. And continue with the upgrades. Worst case scenario, I can send scenarios from the top or bottom barrack. On mid. But that's a bad idea. Sending super unit on mid is most of the time a bad, bad idea. He can be pulled to someone's base. Not go straight, but get pulled like on the top or on the bottom. And he will be like uh, just held hostage because units don't get there, but the only it's only super unit against the wave, you know, something like that. Big brain, Richard extracts. Why no up for attack? Toro needs to upgrade attack. Yes, yes, I know what he is doing. He has to upgrade attack to eight, like as soon as, to be honest, but it's fine. Probably learning how to play, like doing some crazy strat. Okay, we are taking. Skipping all the mercenary upgrades, skipping defensive upgrades, skipping everything. <laughs> Just rushing. Rushing for the unit's power, you know? Oh boy. Eight six upgrades by Richard. Dude, that's that's looking very scary. That's looking very scary to me. Uh, okay, let's get Caster Upgrade first, perhaps. It gives you Lesser Star of All, the most important spell on your talents. More mana region, more damage, more everything, so it's good. Um, and yeah, then save up all the barracks upgrades, cause... Oop! Angry Direhorn. This is one of the worst uh, throws foundations, in my opinion, because they go hostile. You see that? And it's it's pretty unsure if it's if it was worth it because it kills your own units. Yeah. Oh well. There's a green totem, green wolf. On the middle. Yeah. He also gets entangled 24-7. Okay. I feel like I gotta match the the barrack on the middle first. Like that's pretty important. If you can combine it with max mind control, it works. Yeah, maybe. Actually, yo, that's a very smart idea. I never heard something like that. Maxing mind control and going for these. Yeah, they can work. They can work. Yo. Some 500 IQ strats. Okay, going for more damage. 
But you can't attack your strat, what the fuck? Yeah, true. True, I don't know. <laughs> Who is this guy? So smart. This doesn't look like a star fall. Uh, let me see. See? Little, little, little star fall. When that shit goes crazy near your barrack. <laughs> no, that fuck goes crazy. Yeah. Okay, I have 7 upgrades on damage, trying to go for the max number of it as fast as possible. Can't reach his hero yet, I need to pull it again. Okay, can I do it now? Nope. I, be, I should be very very careful, I have 0 upgrades on mercenary. Absolute 0. And zero upgrades on base damage too. Okay, he's somewhat manner of, but to which side? Mine, middle. Kappa, okay, okay. Good, thank you. It's very important because, yeah, if it's middle, then I have to uh, collect units, uh, collect gold and prepare for scenarios. But... And before it's still middle. <laughs> that will be a bit, uh, yeah, a little bit bad for me, you know. Just a little bit. I think I'm dead. Okay, uh, yeah, I could upgrade the barrack. So I, now I have ancient defenders, uh, my siege units, and uh, yeah, now it makes sense to upgrade nature's wrath a little bit at least. For infernal of mana, use your X. Just like yeah, try try to use everything you have on your base. Four head. <laughs> I feel like I'm fine, especially if I will yeah, kill the low HP ones. Okay, so we have 9-6 upgrades. Yeah, I need to make it to 9-9 as fast as possible. Then we can roll. Voodoo! Can't smack units. Uh, I had to use some tank, to be honest. The middle wave uh, is helping on top, nice. Just how much voodoo? He's charming my units, mate, what the hell? So there is a voodoo message when he charms my unit. Mine controls it. It's pretty OP, if you ask me. Pretty OP. Check out GPM. Yeah, Richard is leading by a lot. Oh boy, oh boy. Kinda of feels like I can't get into the passives until I get my 9-9 upgrades and upgrade my all my barracks to tier 4 or something. You know, this kind of logic. And also I need to get my scenarios going. There is a tier 4 barrack by him on middle. I don't know about that, to be honest. Not gonna match it, I think. Not gonna match it. I'm waiting for the torrent to upgrade his barrack to tier 4, to be honest. Maybe gonna do it myself first too. I don't know, we'll see. A very good upgrade by the way is the solid boulders. Uh, like it's excellent thing. A best chance that works on heroes and super units, you know. Yeah, only for one second though, but yeah, it's it's still good. And and your base. And your base towers. So yeah. Okay. Final upgrade on the defense. And we are pretty stacked, like we are we are really stacked. Fully upgraded uh, units. 
except for trains and ancient defenders. Duty free barrack. Okay. So then after that, uh, I feel like one point in Moon Glaive is very good. Crit is very good, at least a few points. Poison has to be maxed out. Vengeance is also good late game. Solid Borders is also good. One point in Aim or Synergy is good. And these two are bad. Like, these are the only upgrades that I don't want to see on myself, you know. It's gonna be me though, imagine if the uh, Dire Horn goes crazy now and targets your barrack, Kappa. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't want it to happen. Some of the hero, huh? Okay, 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 okay. Ah, uh, let's think about it. What I want the most? Poison. Let's get one more po poison level. Keep upgrading this damage now. Also is good. Animal synergy is not bad. Crit is not bad. <laughs> we have still zero mercenary by the way. Okay, pushing me back. It was actually a very good game, it lasted 1 hour and 20 minutes. So the second rehost was successful. You rehosted one more, one more time and it worked for you? Is that how it was? More than 1 hour LTF. It was good, cup. <laughs> True. Alright, um, hmm. Okay, let's get one more, one point in Creed. One point in Creed. Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, Mandarov is coming. How am I pushing, by the way, you on mid when I have tier 3 barrack this whole time? On the middle. That is so weird. That is so weird. Okay, poison is not there yet. Let's get a Moonglaive level 2 or... Oh my god, what is happening here? There is a spike and a manner of... This is a chaos. Complete chaos. Second hero on top. Okay. Um, let's get maybe one upgrade in animal synergy, yeah, why not? Manner of on meat, by the way. Yeah, I could upgrade the barrack. Um, I feel like I could upgrade the barrack when it's gonna be closer a little bit or something. I don't know. Wait, why you have so little HP on your main? <laughs> what is going on? Yo, where is your HP on main? Okay. I know. I feel like he's not pushing me. I killed his hero already, and second hero is dying as well. Looks bad. Let's go upgrades here, yeah, let's go upgrades. I feel like I need those, Research right? Great Lord of Seth. Well, yes. But, like, what can I do, man? I'm always greedy like that. I'm always greedy like that. I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of gold soon. Yep. So, pushing the upgrades is the way. I did, wait, why didn't I get gold for his barrack? 
What the f? I know why, but I didn't get this gold for the gold for is bad. I could tell. Oh boy. Okay. Good luck, Zoom. Thank you. Wait, why? Why was he coming so close? Lee. He has a bit of range, but not like super a lot. Yeah, should be fine now. Should be fine now. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? What? <laughs> How did he have so much gold? What the fuck? Hello? Uh, well, guys, we have a problem here. Shit. Was it doing some upgrade? My hero wrecked everything. Nah. With this push, it wouldn't be anything, but because of his ultimate weapon, I didn't think he would send me an ultimate weapon, you know? He would shoot it at me. Like, that was. What the fuck was that? Like, I don't know, dude. Um. Okay, I need, I need poison level 3. Poison, I need what? Maybe solid boulders. Vengeance. Let's go, vengeance. It's a good like, game. Like this game. When he knows you chose ma mana steel, it's easy choice. Usually it's risky because people can use shield. Like, he's playing against uh, way more players than only me. If he uses this against me, like, he's exposed to others, you know? No, like... He just got salty. For no reason. I was mana draining because he had, like, the most mana by the time. That's it. Like, what is this kind of logic? He, he used his single target ability on me. When he could have, like, I know. He still has to play against this guy with Iron Tusk. This guy with his uh, fucking Dire Horns and shit, you know? As whole self on it again. A sub gang drama. No, I mean like I don't understand why he's calling me out for using this shit on him when he has the most mana. It's logical, no? Like I don't know. I had low mana. Okay. 
It's a uh, scenarius Tyrande and Furion against Manorov. Oh boy. Fight of a year. I have so much cash right now, like, Jesus. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, the problem with the uh, mana drain is... I... I can't, I can't launch my upgrades while you're mana draining, you know? I can't do that. That's a lot of units there, mate. So yeah, I have to wait until I finish all my upgrades, and then I can start mana draining 24-7. Wait, is Manarov killing me on mid for you? Well, it's true I don't have a middle barrack and that's a tier 3 barrack only, but... Come on, dude, like, it can't be that bad. It, ca it, ca it can't be that bad, right? What the fuck? Oh, man. Alright. Catching up on mercenary now. Just trying to. Lore accurate. Vengeance, solid boulders free. After poison, we gotta get what? what do we get crit. I feel like yeah, I feel like it's crit. It's gonna be a critical hit. So this is my fifth upgrade on mercenary, right? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, see, poison affects uh, the super units, and it's very OP. Like, he mainly takes damage to the poison right now, I believe. They repair the barracks. Research. Research. Well, well done, defending uh, with bottom, by the way. Very well done. Only a tower lost. <laughs> yeah, that's what you get for sending a super unit on me, fucking retard. Now what? Now what? Hmm, I have my air, but like, should I use her? Nah. Not really. My upgrades are being made so slowly, like, Night Elf is so powerful, but yeah, the upgrades... is 20%, resource speed is... oh my god. I have the most resources done right now. Oop, my heroes are reaching me though. Zoom, get him. I pulled him for you. Nice. But yeah, it's not being supported by tier 4 barrack. Dito RNG. Again. Yeah, sure thing. Manner of meat and ultimate weapon. On the guy who mana drained you once. Yeah, sure thing. Good RNG. Like, if someone wanna drains me once, I don't shoot an ultimate weapon at him, you know? Come on, can you destroy the barrack? Snarius is not really dying. Gimme, give gimme. Give there you go. Triple hero bottom. 
Alright, nice. Keep on making upgrades, I have too much gold. Way, way, way too much gold. Right now. <laughs> Lost a fortress, but... Yeah, what the fuck? I think I gotta use units now. Because this fight gonna be a very long one. Yep, they're coming. He really, want, he really wants my tower. Dude, come on. Jesus. Okay, crit level 3. Uh, animal synergy now. More damage upgrades. We made it out alive, guys. Somewhat. Why so salty? Who? Me? No, I'm not salty. Am I salty? He he is salty, I'm not salty. <laughs> I'm almost fully upgraded. Like maxed out wisps, maxed out story boulders, maxed out poison, maxed out uh crit soon. I'm gonna finish the animal synergy. And that's it. Uh, yep, yeah, so we have a triple hero push on the bottom. It's coming, coming. Soon. Uh, math is holding me though. But yeah, if Rich sends to me something, the green Felhor player, I feel like I'm going to lose. Uh, mid control and everything. Alright, let's see how it goes. Triple hero push. Super late game night elf. Yeah, to be honest, I feel like uh, mana drain was a big mistake because uh, my upgrades are very slow. Like I have to finish all my upgrades before I can mana drain. It interrupts it. So like yeah, it was just a bad idea. I feel like I, I should have researched the ultimate weapon and not use it yet. Or use the mana burn instead. Instead of mana leak, use the mana burn. That could have been a better idea. I don't know. Uh, Red is suffering from my units a lot. Right now. Okay, after the crit, what do I wanna get? Yeah, probably Moon Glaives and. Uh, oof. Transmorph is pretty cheap, like it couldn't be too bad. The beer form is expensive and bad. It's expensive and bad. Scenarios got pulled and dying. There's a mana shield, so my mana leak is very good against that. Very, very good. Okay, lost the fortress. So no more units on the right side spawning. Okay, so Narius has his item. Now my buildings are regenerating fast AF. Look, look at this region on my base. Because of scenarios. Man, like, this is insane. <laughs> Yo, this is literally insane. Okay. And now we're gonna get... Maybe trends. Probably trends. Did I kill you, Iron Task? 
Did I just kill you iron that what the fuck? At your base? As well. Yeah man like look at my building's HP region. Why scenarios is good, but yeah, like it's a very late game situation. Like a super ga late game situation. It's very hard to get to this point. By any means. There is nothing to mana drain now. Okay, I want I want a quadruple hero push on top. All right, that might finish all for Richardic. Mineroff is beginning on the bottom right now. They're gonna be a push on the middle. Uh, we got this. We got this. Okay, just gonna use my, all my gold for the units and should be fine. So yeah, triple push on the top with the scenarios. He also buffs the ancients damage, like plus 25%. Not only regeneration, but also that. So yeah, it's pretty OP. Base race, yep, it's a, gonna be a base race. I wonder how much gold you have though. Okay, which one gonna be faster? I don't know. Can I mana drain from something? Like a mechanical unit? I don't think so. <laughs> the whole game I have been making the tower upgrades and I still don't have all of them because they are so slow. Yeah, my base is insane, under these uh, scenarios buffs, 5 HP per second, and the 25% damage, with 12 upgrades, like scenarios is suiting night elves so much, so much. Yeah, so Manarov is uh, pushing through, but there is like a cairn blocking the way. There are no towers for reach. It's only a lonely barrack. He can't really pull me away or anything. But as to be said, all my heroes are right now on the cooldown. Like all of them are on the cooldown, on the bottom and top. So if I were to lose right now, yeah, that would be GG. Because I can't do shit. Math is reuniting with all the heroes. All right. Alright, 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 alright. Good, good, good. Yeah, I feel like this one is GGP. Well, Gromon scenarios, GG. Oh boy. Yeah, we'll play by Richard. I feel like he got a lot of hate on him. Very weird strat. Uh, he could have done the caster upgrades, probably I would lose then. Like, but yeah, GP. I don't think Manarov is that OP, to be frank with you. As uh, Scenarios is OP. Like, Scenarios buffing the base so much, his HP regeneration is insane. Just for the reference, Lumber Mill gives you 0 0.75 per second, right? It's And it's like a late game situation, it already gives you way less. Then your mercenary gives you like, I don't know, probably 2 HP region per second. All the mercenary upgrades together. And then, and then you have scenarios. Flat 5. Like, it's so OP. It's so broken. But yeah, GP, cool game, cool game.